Hi, today's problem is in humans the blood groups are produced by various combinations of three alleles A, B and O. Suppose the child is of blood type A and the mother is of type O. What type O types may the father belong to? And um, in order to solve this problem we have to make a list of all the possible genotypes and phenotypes. But before that, I want to show you uh, notations that you may find in the textbook. Blood group A would be notated as IA. Blood group B would be notated as IB. And uh, blood group O would be notated just as I. And A and B is codominant alleles. And these two codominant alleles would be dominant over the I. So, uh, but I prefer to use just um, A, B, and O, uh, because this is uh, just more simplified way to show the same thing. Those, this notation on the left has its own uh, meaning, because um, um, allele I here is a precursor of the antigens A and B and um, as you see here it's always present uh, in uh, antigen A and antigen B and when it's by itself uh, we just um, use this for to designate uh, genotype II and phenotype O. So I would use uh, the system on the right that is more simplified and would be uh, easier for you to understand. So uh, what different genotypes we may have here. And um, for example, phenotype A can be produced by two genotypes, AA and AO. And this is going to be one phenotype A. And uh, phenotype B can also consist of two um, genotypes, BB and B. O and uh, phenotype AB only can be made when two alleles A and B present. So this is going to be uh, phenotype AB and phenotype O can be made by two alleles OO. So this is going to be phenotype O. And from this problem we know that uh, mother belongs to the group blood group O, so to this um, blood group, and the only phenotype, pos uh, the only genotype possible for this blood group is uh, when two alleles are OO. So uh, also we know that uh, phenotype of the child is A, blood group A, and there are two possible combinations, A, A and AO. And uh, as long as mother only can give to this child uh, one of the alleles and both of them would be O, so we instantly know that uh, child genotype would be AO. And uh, this allele he here, uh, that is O, would be inherited from the mother side. So this allele A the child can inherit only from the father side. So let's now consider which um, genotypes and phenotypes can give this allele A to this child. So of course this is, would be uh, one possible genotype of the father. So this genotype can give one allele A. And this is also another possible genotype that would give one allele a, and um, this is would be the third genotype that would also can give this child uh, one allele A. So these three circled uh, genotypes would be our answer to this problem. Thank you for attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Goodbye.